What's good YouTube? It's Franilations here with a, another sneaker video. Uh, it's been a while since I pulled out the HD camera. I've got a ton of recent pickups that I figured definitely deserve that HD quality. Here's the lineup and let's get right into them right now. Okay guys, so first off we have the All-Star All Game LeBron uh, 11s. We'll start with that outsole right there. Very awesome colored outsole as you can see. Leading up to the foam posit, which is glow in the dark and has a pattern on it. You have a glow in the dark swoosh with um, some etching into that as well. A metallic purple fading to green um, lining right there on the upper. You got your purple mesh with the hyperfuse behind it. The pattern has a glow in the dark logo with the gold crown on top. A pretty cool print on that tongue and an even cooler print on the inner lining as well as a very detailed insole. So there's that sneaker. Next up, we have the KDs, the Aunt Pearls. Shout outs to uh, the homie on Instagram who hooked it up. I'll have his Instagram name down below. Um, definitely good looking out, uh, grabbing these for retail for me. Pink translucent outsole, silver midsole with the pink air bubble. The pink flower upper, Blue swoosh. One of my favorite detailings is this see-through translucent blue tongue. Very cool. Through that you can see the, the flower pattern on the side as well. Pink swoosh right there. Blue with pink polka dot in, insole right there. Awesome, awesome sneaker. And you can't forget the little breast cancer logo on the tongue as well. Next up we have the undefeated Air Force One Lunar Highs. The lows were definitely very cool as well, but to me the highs were just much more popping, so I went with them. You have your off-white midsole with the off-white, I'm sorry, off-white outsole with the off-white midsole that has black speckles on it. You have your undefeated pattern, um, much like what we saw on the Air Force Ones years ago, um, on that strap right there, orange inner liner, this awesome red suede upper. Uh, the extra laces on it were red and orange, I went the white. You have your hyperfused tongue um, that says undefeated and it has the little undefeated logo as well. Your lace tips say undefeated. Your lace lock says Air Force One and has undefeated under that. All around an amazingly dope shoe. Can't forget the really cool insole as well. Next up we have not one but two amazingly beautiful Air Maxes. For those that don't know, these are the Kid Robot Air Maxes. This is the uh, very limited version that hit retails. Um, it hit one store, a Barney's in New York, New York. There was only 250 pairs. And let's get right into it. You got your gum bottom, which is actually more of a goldish tint, really. Off-white midsole, black leather upper, very buttery leather, by the way. Gold hit right there, pink hit right here, pink laces, pink tongue patch, pink inner liner, and the leather on the inside is very, very good. Uh, you got your kid robot pattern on the insole, and the pink hit right here and the gold hit right there are both uh, 3M. Next up are the friends and family version of the shoe, and in my opinion, the much better version. Um, way more pop to it, and yeah, let's get into it. Gold um, outsole with the gold midsole. Pink leather upper with red leather hits right here. You got your red 3M with your light pink 3M right there. Light pink laces, light pink tongue patch. Light pink inner liner with the very cool pattern on the insole. Uh, these are awesome. They both came in yesterday and I wore these right away. Super dope. And lastly and definitely not least, the red Yeezy 2s. Uh, there was you know, a lot of talk about these not happening, especially after uh, Kanye West left Nike uh, for Adidas. And then boom, one Sunday morning we were randomly blessed with the Yeezus 2s. Easy twos, the red Februarys, the red Octobers, whatever you want to call them, uh, we got them, and here it is. And let's get right into it. You got that red um, outsole that glows in the dark, and as you can see, yes, I have worn the shoe. Um, your red midsole with the red air bubble, uh, off red suede, kind of like a lighter red suede. Your red strap, red mesh, your red little uh, like spikes on it. Very cool detailing, and they're actually, you know, pretty sturdy spikes, kind of have a little sharp point to them. Um, that same material is used on the lace lock right there. 
You got your little Yeezy logo on the tongue. The inside right there, very nice. And yeah, there they are. I'm going to kind of zoom into a few things um, to kind of show you guys some of the detailing as well as some of the errors that were found on this shoe. There's a zoom and in look at the upper. I'm going to change sides over here. And on the air bubble, I'm not sure if you're going to be able to tell, but there is definitely paint that shows up on the air bubble itself. Um, rather than just staying on the midsole. Let me try to focus a little bit for you guys. You can kind of see it on the left side right there, but um, definitely a lot more visible in person. And not a good look in my opinion. Next up, there's glue all throughout the shoe, but kind of notably right there, as well as in a lot of other places. So, in a lot of cases, I feel like this would be considered a B grade, but, um, you know, it is what it is. We got them, and uh, I'm definitely not complaining. I'm just pointing it out for those that may not know. And lastly, I'd like to give a shout out to Slight. They definitely hooked it up with some uh, clothing. Uh, so definitely go check them out, guys. I'll have their Instagram linked below. And, uh, yeah. Check out their page. As always, thank you guys for tuning in. Make sure to like, subscribe, comment, and um, I'll see you guys later. Thanks for your support. Peace.